Hello again, ladies and gents. Um, just another quick video from me on 3D Vista. Um, I haven't got a, a, web, a video at the moment because my camera is knackered, so um, I need to get a new one of those. Anyway, um, I saw a post recently on Facebook um, from somebody just asking uh, how the Google Street View integration worked with 3D Vista. So I thought I'd throw up a quick video just to run through how it all uh, operates and uh, how easy it is really. Um, so what I've got up here is just one of my tools. I've just loaded it um, from the from the main menu uh, through my tools here. Um, so if I open that up, I can the tool ready. Okay, right. Okay, so where I want to be if I want to publish uh, this to Google Street View is obviously on the publish tab. Um, click on publish in the bottom right hand corner. Uh, uncheck that and then tick to Google Street View. Now I've got my Google user uh, account here already. Uh, when you first use this, you will be asked to sign in. Um, but obviously I'm already signed in there. So if I click on edit tour, it's gonna bring all of the images within the tour into here. Um, I'll probably just, yeah, I'll, I'll just select all of them. Uh, you can select individuals if you, want to, if you want to omit some images from um, Google Street View, but I'll just click on select all. Um, now, I won't go through the whole connection process of connecting all the images, but I will show you how it all works. Uh, it's going to be very, very quick because it's very, very quick and easy to use. So first thing we need to do is click on Add Business in the top left-hand corner here. And if I just search for this nursery. Nursery. Drive in Brighton. There we go. So it's being very, very slow at the moment. There we go. Right. So I can either view this on a map view or a satellite view. Obviously, probably easier to view it on satellite. Um, right. I want to see it from right above. There we go. Okie dokie. Right, so nursery is here. Now, what I need to do is click on which ones I want to place on the map. Um, I'll do them one by one just to make it a little bit easier. But this one is obviously outside the front of the property. So I highlight that and then just click place on map and then move the pin to wherever the image was taken, which was about here. Um, and then face that forwards and then we can see if you want to adjust that we can face it this way which is obviously the wrong way but it moves with it so you need to ensure that you are facing directly at the door like so and then we will grab the reception one and we'll place that one as well which is about here, just there. Okay, so if I face that forward as well, because we're facing forward into the reception here, turn around, and then we'll see there that this number one here is showing us um, where the other set, the other shot is. So I might want to move that across slightly. So number two is showing centrally. There we go. Uh, now let's go into another room. So this one here is located on the left of the building. So if I click place on map and then move that forward slightly. Go and then make sure that this is facing towards the garden, which you can see through the doors here. It's through there. Um, now the little black line you can see between the t these um, hotspots here or points that there's a, a black line there. That's basically means that those images are linked. Um, if you want to unlink them, you basically just click on them um, to uh, to unlink those. 
Uh, sometimes if they're a bit too close together, it can get a bit confused. So all I do is just stretch it out. And then click there, there we go. So you've now unlinked those. So just make sure that they're connected and then bring that nicely back into place, just so. Okay, um, and then you basically just go through each one. I'll do one more, um, doing the same thing. So I always, I always go to drag it. Um, so that's about here. That's facing out this way here. Okay, um, and that is pretty much that. That's how easy it is. Um, so what you do is you just go through each of those, just connecting all of your images. Uh, do remember that uh, if they aren't connecting, um, then let's see, I'm double clicking on that and it's not not working. So you just put it out slightly. Um, I, it might be worth just stretching all of these out and just making sure they're connected the way that you want them to be connected, like I'd want them to be able to go from this one to that one. So double click on this line here. There we go. So that's the, those two are now connected as well. Um, yeah, I hope that helps. Uh, any questions, please feel free to pop them in the comments below. Um, and don't forget that if you are looking for 3D Vista, I am still offering the uh, discount. So uh, if that is of interest, then uh, click on the link in the description below, which will take you to my website. Uh, pop your details in there and then I will send you over a 50 euro discount link for 3D Vista Pro. Um, yeah, thanks for your time and um, I will speak to you again soon. Take care, bye.